Hi everybody, if you want to boost your business profits and you're a business owner and find staying motivated tricky some days, well I'd like to chat today about staying motivated around creating social media content or blog content for that matter as well. Today I was speaking with a business owner and she wants to boost her business profits but what she also wants to do is to get a lot of messages out to the market but she was saying I know I should be doing it, I know I have to do it but what can I possibly write about? And what you possibly can write about is what you are the expert in. So it's really simple. I've got some notes here because I really wanted to, to chat with you carefully about this. And it's what can you put out to the market that will truly educate your buyers, the people who buy your products, the people who are likely to buy your products. What can you educate them about? And what information will they really truly value and will they truly love to hear? So if you want to stay motivated, think about the problems that you solve and think about the reasons why people buy from you. Those are the things that you can then create your social media content about, your blogs about, and then you can get out to the marketplace because you're giving something truly valuable to those people who really want to be able to um, learn from you and who want to purchase from you. They just don't know it yet. But what we don't want to do, what we don't want to do is try and send a message of what we can tell them how they can buy our products. We don't necessarily want to do that. Hi there, Gillian, lovely to see you. We don't necessarily want to send a message about the products that we're selling because what we're doing is we're adding value, we're adding great content, and we're giving something of enormous value. So when it is time to buy, which could be 30, 60, 90 days, hi Gillian, it could be, it could even sometimes, if you're selling large products, sometimes, it could be a year out before someone is ready to buy from you. But if you have been giving them amazing content and giving them fantastic um, tips on how to make whatever it is that you do in your world better. Now, for instance, imagine um, if you were someone who dealt with interior decoration. If you were an interior decorator, hi Susie, how are you? Great to see you. Um, Susie, if you were an interior decorator, imagine if you could put out to the marketplace how to uh, take out an old window and put in a new window. Imagine if you could talk to them about tiles and what the best tiles are for certain types of houses, certain types of rooms. Imagine if you were a, um, in, a, a interior decorator and you were looking at outdoor furniture. What's the best outdoor furniture for certain sorts of um, backyards, for certain sorts of um, weather conditions? Where we are, we get quite a lot of wind here. Love living here, but we do get a lot of wind. So we've, our um, lounge suites have to be pretty stable, otherwise they get blown away. So what is it that you can educate your people on, people who are going to buy from you and people that have already bought from you? And then, you can stay motivated about creating content because usually that's something you love. If you're in a business that you love and you want to boost your business profits, you'll, be, you'll have lots of things that you can talk to people about. So that's it for me today. Staying motivated around creating social media posts or blog posts can be great. Just think of how you solve people's problems and then send out the solution. Send it out, send it out, send it out, send it out. And eventually, when it's time for them to buy, they'll think, aha, I know who I need to speak to. So that's it for today. Chat to you again really soon. Bye for now.